Hey guys, so The Bachelorette um, season finale just started and um, it is now the commercial so I know the lighting is a little bit weird but that's okay. Um, I am a huge fan of The Bachelorette. Um, I'm not really, I am a little bit skeptical about whole, the whole like love, finding love that way thing but I feel like it's a really entertaining show and if you can find love that way that's great. So. Um, Personally, I am on team JP. I feel like JP is the one for her. Like, they have a connection, like, from the beginning, like, no other. But, um, yeah, I just watched, like, the first thing of it. Like, this is the first commercial break, and her sister said, like, absolutely not. I will not see you guys together. So, I don't know. Please leave down in the comments below. Tell me what you think. Who do you think Ashley should be with? Or whatever, if or if you guys even watch Bachelor or not. Anyway, so what I'm gonna pretty much be doing is kind of going um, through like not every single commercial because that's a lot because this is like a two-hour show. I am just gonna probably like do like two or three clips, like telling me, telling you guys how I feel about it and stuff, and who she finally picks at the end and stuff. And I'm just pretty much gonna share my thoughts. And so just kind of like a random vlog that I don't know. I just love Bachelorette. And so, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy this kind of random thing, and I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. Hey guys, so this is going to be like a quick little thing. Um, her and her sister are like fighting, and I feel like her sister is being so judgmental. I mean, like, why would you even bring up Brad Womack? I mean, seriously? Um... I don't know. I just I just don't like her sister, and I am in Team JP, so whatever. Her sis I mean, I feel like even if you do, if even if you are um, like in Team Ben, I feel like you should be able to see how tough and rude she was to him. So like either way, if she doesn't approve to approve him, like if she doesn't like him, she could say in a much nicer way than just flat out saying you're not the one for him and being like totally harsh and yeah a little like bitchy so okay so yeah so I will be back with more with like Ben's um yeah family thingies so. hey guys so I just finished watching the part when Ben actually met with her family and her family loved Ben and it was actually pretty funny and um, like he really does bring out like the goofiness in her and even though I like JP better like just it's just for me I feel like the passion thing that like, they have it's just like it's very strong and I don't think she has that with Ben F. I mean, obviously, they love each other, but they don't have that deep, deep love. I don't know if you guys can get it. If you guys have seen at least, like, half of the season, you'd know what I'm talking about. But anyway, I feel like, um, what Be um, I feel like she is going to pick Ben, and even though I'm sad for JP and everything, I feel like there is somebody else for JP out there, and maybe it was just wasn't her. But, um, yeah, I feel like what her and JP has is, like, very strong, and it's definitely, like, I don't know, it's very, like, unique, but her and Ben, I feel like they're just, like, boyfriend and girlfriend, something, like, in the high school kind of stage, college, but a little bit more serious, but I feel like they don't have, um that long-term relationship thing I mean I could kind of see it but not as much as I can see it with Ben so that is just my opinion and um, I am just gonna wait till it is till one of them actually proposes and then there's the end thing that they always do like the hour like review and jigger with Chris Harrison so I am going to t whoa I look red Okay, I am going to tell you guys about that soon, so I hope you guys are enjoying your night, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, so it is the finally, like for two hours, this is the moment we've been waiting for, to see who is the first person to go to her, because we all know that it's the person that she's going to reject, sadly. But there she is, all dramatic. I don't, hurry up! I don't like her dress that much, do you? So... 
this is gonna be okay. And I want to show you guys like a. I want to be. Like, I want to be like live for you guys. So. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay. Who is this? Oh my god, who is it? Hurry up! Ashley, shut up! It's Ben. It's, J it's JP. Watch it be Ben. It's JP. Oh, his black socks. It's Ben. It's JP. Is it Ben? It's Ben. It's Ben. <gasps> oh my god, it's Ben! Hi, Ben. Hey, Chris. Good to see you again. Ben Thanks. is the first guy that came out. That means he's the one that's gonna get dumped. Yeah, Oh my god, I thought it was gonna be with Ben, even though I'm in Team JP. I've never come either remotely close to proposing before. Do you guys hear her, his voice? I am so shocked right now. Okay, I'm gonna watch this and then do like a little rant, like nastiness later. So, <laughs> I am so surprised as Ben, aren't you guys? This is a hell of a story. I guess that's it, right? I am so shocked, you guys. Oh my god, I'm so sad. Look at it. Hey guys, so I am so surprised that she picked. JP, I mean, I love him, and I wanted her to pick him from the beginning, but I thought that it would be Ben, but OMG, I'm happy for her, but I'm so shocked and kind of sad, but I am excited for who she ended up with, and I just, oh, I just wish the best for Ben, I guess, so, um, that is the end of my little rambly kind of vlog thing. I am still going to stay. There's, there's like a whole more hour. And yeah. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.